What's happening everyone? My name is Alex and welcome back. In today's video we are checking out the latest fitness tracker from Xiaomi and probably the cheapest um, fitness tracker from Xiaomi. So the one that I have today it's called the Xiaomi Redmi Band and this is a fitness tracker that you can buy for somewhere between $15 and $30. Of course it really depends when and where you buy it from and as always there will be some links in the video's description. So what do we get for that price? Well, first of all, we get a 1.08 inch um, color display. This screen may not be the best screen that I've ever seen on a fitness tracker. However, it does have adjustable brightness and it gets bright enough to be used outdoors. And that's definitely important. The fitness band also supports that feature where the screen comes on every time you turn the arm towards yourself. It takes about half a second for the screen to come on, but for the price, I think it works really good. We also get a fitness band that's waterproof, so if you take this in the shower or swimming, um, there won't um, be any problems um, afterwards. You also get two weeks on one charge. Now, it really depends how you use the fitness band, of course. If you don't get constant notifications, if the band doesn't have to vibrate every three seconds, you're probably going to get even more than two weeks. But if it vibrates constantly, you're probably going to get two weeks or less. Charging this is also a bit awkward. So you have to take it off. You have to basically pull out the rubber band from it and then plug it in um, in a charger. It works with pretty much any phone charger that um, you have. So you can't really use this while charging. It takes about two hours um, to fully charge it from zero to a hundred. Now on the back, we also have a heart rate monitor. So this can uh, monitor your heart rate throughout the day. But of course, it really depends if you want your heart rate to be monitored 24 seven. To do that, um, you have to basically open the app. There is an app that works with this and um, you select however um, often you need your heart rate to be monitored. So very simple. And um, most people are probably gonna use this um, to monitor their heart rate 24 seven. Now, whenever you're doing any sporting activities, even if you have the heart rate monitoring turned off, uh, the heart rate monitor will work. So even if you don't use it 24 seven, every time you go for a walk, for a run or for a bike ride, um, this will track your heart rate as well. Now, the band itself doesn't look anything spectacular. It's mostly made out of plastic, except for uh, the screen. Of course, the screen seems to be covered by glass. But the band itself looks somewhat cheap and bulky, if you ask me. And uh, if you'd be to compare this to the Xiaomi Mi Band 4, well, I definitely prefer the Mi Band 4. It just looks a bit better. It has a better screen and it looks more premium than this one. This one feels a bit on the cheaper side, but I mean, it is pretty cheap. So what can I say about that? So the entire band is made out of um, plastic. Now on the screen, well, I mean at the bottom of the screen, there is a little button and if you want to turn on the screen, you basically tap that um, little button. The same goes um, if you're like doing an activity like a walking activity or running activity. When you want to turn off that activity, you basically hold that button um, pressed. So that's how you interact um, with the band. And the screen is also a touch screen, so you can swipe up or down, um, left or right. So very simple to use. So the band will keep track of all the steps that you do throughout the day, the calories that you burned and of course the distance. You can also see the weather if the band is connected to your um, smartphone. It will also show you the notifications that you get on your smartphone. Um, now on the smartphone you can select what apps can send you notifications because you definitely don't want all the apps to send you notifications. So me personally I just um, use the notifications from WhatsApp and text messages. Now, whenever you get a notification, you basically get to read the text. However, if you get multiple notifications, so multiple messages from the same app. So let's say that on WhatsApp, you get three messages from three different people at the same time. It's only going to show that you have three messages from three different contacts. So you can't exactly see each individual um, notification. And of course, you're not going to be able to reply um, to any notification. So you basically see them and then you have to take out your phone if you want to reply to them. Now this, um, as I said earlier, it will also show you your um, weather and you can also change um, the home screen. To change the home screen, you have three home screens available on the band itself. But if you want more, you can basically open the app. The app is called the Xiaomi Wear app. And there are a lot of um, watch faces that you can select from there. But um, you have to download each one individually. And every time you want to change it, you basically have to open the app and select a new one. The band will also allow you to change the music on your smartphone. So let's say that you're using Spotify on your phone um, and you have some headphones on. You can basically turn this on or touch the, the button underneath the screen. Then you can change the song right from the fitness tracker. So you don't actually have to pull out... Um, your phone to do that. 
Now, to do some sporting activities, this, well, the band doesn't have GPS inside, so it depends if you're using this with a phone, because if you have the phone with you, it will use the phone's GPS, but if you use it and you leave the phone at home, it's basically not gonna have um, GPS tracking. It will basically guess your distance and speed and so on. But when you have um, the phone with you, it will um, use the phone's GPS and it will give you more accurate um, tracking, basically. In order to use the band with your phone, of course, you're gonna have to install an app on your phone. And the app, it's called the Xiaomi Wear. Now, this may not be available on the Google Play Store. At least here in Canada, it's not available on the Google Play Store. But um, you can scan uh, the QR code from the user manual and then you can install it on any Android phone. And I'm sure it will become available um, in the Google Play Store in the near future. So through the app, you can change certain settings. You can do updates for this. And technically, you should be able to see all the steps that you've done, the heart rate monitoring and um, the sleep. Now, I'm not sure why. Maybe it's too early. Maybe the app is not ready. But... The app, in my case at least, doesn't show the steps, doesn't show my heart rate, doesn't show the distance that I've done. So on the app, I cannot see anything. And I've installed the app, I tried installing it on a different phone, I reset the band, I, I tried to do everything that I can. So as of now, the app doesn't exactly work. So the band is actually connected to the, to the phone because you can change the watch faces, you can change the settings from it, but it does want to sync all the information, so the steps, the heart rate, and so on, to the app. And as I said, I'm sure that it will be fixed in the near future, but as of right now, uh, it just doesn't work um, as it should. It's a shame, but um, reality as of now. So, should you buy the Xiaomi Redmi Band? Well, personally, I would skip this one and I would buy um, the Xiaomi Mi Band 4. I prefer that one because it's smaller, it looks better, and realistically, it's not that much uh, much more expensive. You can probably find that one for around $20, $25 the most, where this one is like $4 or $5 cheaper. So it really depends if you want to spend that extra $4 or $5. But this basically does everything that the Xiaomi Mi Band 4 does, but it looks a bit different, and um, it has a lower quality screen. So there you have it. This is the Xiaomi Redmi Band. I'm not sure why this exists, to be honest, because they could have just decreased the price of the Mi Band 4 by $2 or $3 and it would have been the same. But if you're looking for um, a new fitness band, you can probably try um, this one. If you do have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below and I'll try to answer um, whatever um, questions um, you may have. Um, if you did like the video, don't forget to press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.